This is from Steph in Belgium and says, hello, I'm a listener. I listened to your podcast. I saw on the YouTube channel, Energy Transition Crisis, we still need to build out 50 fold the current amount of solar and wind to completely get off fossil fuels by 2050. So I wonder what multiple of renewable generation is actually needed for full decarbonization. His promise is we'll have energy crisis this decade by not being able to ramp up renewables fast enough and having not enough investment and potential to extract fossil fuels. I looked at the video and I had some problems with it. Brian has some major problems with it. But thank you for your letter, Steph. I will get into this now. Well, I checked out this channel and it's very weird. I did some research on this particular channel. He's released about seven videos calling it a documentary on uh, how tough the transition is going to be. He doesn't uh, overly, you know, say or give links to who he is. I found out that his name is Eric Townsend. He's a hedge fund manager and energy stock trader. Uh, he made it big in computers during the tech boom in the 90s and is now retired with a podcast on investing. And I found it strange because he has a donations page, Brian. The first donation on the donations page is from him for $10,000. <laughs> what does that tell you? It tells me the guy's a wiener, that he's a, a, a scumbag. <laughs> you know, that, 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 that this, the, it's, it's a moral problem. It's an ethical issue if you, you do something like that. And it doesn't say who he is on the on the donations page so yeah he's trying to th and his goal is a million dollars for these seven videos mm -hmm. so i think he's a rat i smell a rat i mean i i looked at the t the information on the video and of course it's it's like any other video that's erroneous it uses real data that's cherry picked that um is often out of date and we've talked about that on the show so i'm not, I'm not going to get into fact checking i don't have the time or the energy to go through all of his videos and fact check them point by point but generally speaking this man is a fossil fuels guy so I'll be an example of the fossil fuel industry paying this guy to make this video i don't know that but i suspect something is very wrong and i think watching a video like this and then getting information like steph did and thinking that it's legitimate and you're trusting it so i don't know what to tell you other than i don't trust him but here's a clip from his show the point we most urgently need to promote understanding of is that stopping investment in oil and gas exploration and production ironically and counterintuitively hinders rather than advances the energy transition agenda as explained in episode three trying to phase out fossil fuels before phasing in viable replacements just plain doesn't make sense just the fact that he says it just plain doesn't make sense he's a, a propagandist you know like it, mm. it just reeks of of uh, bs so guessing that we phase out fossil fuels no. too soon that would be a terrible this, this idea. is a, an oil industry talking point that we hear over yeah. and over again 